Bert Meidler took to Twitter once again to get into the weeds of politics. This time the 72-year-old singer and actress blamed a low minimum wage for the intense scenes at shopping venues on Black Friday. Just one day after America took to stores to reap the benefits of the massive sales that act as the unofficial opening to the holiday season, Meidler took to Twitter where she implied that the sometimes dangerous shopping conditions occur because average Americans find the low cost of these items more of a necessity than a benefit. And how was your Black Friday? No injuries, I hope. It's incredible that we have to fight over stuff. If there were a decent minimum wage, or if workers were treated fairly, and got a tiny portion of the kinds of salaries and bonuses CEOs pay themselves, we wouldn't. The star wrote the reply thread to her tweet is relatively split, with some users chastising the actress for an ill-informed opinion and claiming hypocrisy of making as much as a celebrity. Others, meanwhile, agree with the star's assessment and defend her for her charity work. This isn't the first time in recent weeks that Meidler has courted controversy by way of her social media. In early October, she had to apologize for calling women the N-word of the world. In November. She caught backlash twice in the same week. First, she alleged that President Donald Trump's rhetoric was responsible for the dip in the stock market. She also caught some flack for posting a photo with an inappropriate caption of First Lady Melania Trump. Over time, the star's feed has become a slew of anti-Trump thoughts and articles, despite the fact that her words have gotten her into some hot water in the past.